So, folks, we're here at the car market, and you know what? I'm not bankrupt. Uh, we almost did it last episode, but we managed to pull through. It takes patience in this game to sell vehicles at the price that you want. Uh, you have to say no to a lot of people. Oh, my goodness, there's a nice Ferrari in here. It looks a little dinged up. How much you want for this bad boy? Ten bucks says it's out of my uh, price range. Yep, 355000 Um, No, it's got dings in it. Uh, yeah, there's some new cars here in the market. Haven't been out to the neighborhood. I uh, was kind of eyeing this little hatchback here. What is this thing? It's a Rada hatchback. Uh, looks like 45 kilometers on it. Got a little bit of damage. You know what? 16000 not a bad price. Let's go ahead and get an expert to look at it. So we're going to go ahead and go 5 uh, FK. And let's see what the expert has to say. Is the seller lying to us? By the way, you guys can hit the thumbs up button for some more. Oh, look, it's got more damage uh, than reported there. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, he was lying to us. Okay, you know what? We can work with this. Give me a good price on it, though. Uh, okay, so they went down uh, 1300 You know what? Let's see if we can bargain a bit more. Also, I like how this conversation got really heated. You're a liar and a cheat, and I won't stand for it. You know what? Here, 14000 Will you take that? I'll take a minute. Uh, you got a great deal. All right, so, I mean, we got it for, I would say, a decent deal. Uh, let's send that one to the repair shop. I got 12000 more. Uh, I don't think I can afford any of these other cars. Let's go check the neighborhood real quick, and then we'll work on our cars, and uh, let's see if we can go make some profit here. All right, here we are in the neighborhood. Looks like we've got some, uh, is that like a Tesla or something? Wait, okay, it's textures were loading in. I thought it was, like, completely busted up. I was like, uh, no. Uh, there's a little van over there. Got a small car over there. Uh, anything, like, unique? Anything that we haven't seen before? There's another BMW. We actually uh, had one of these sell last episode. It did really good. Why is it so many different colors? What did you do to this thing? Uh, it's got 60,000 miles. It's a uh, Z3A. Uh, it's actually not in terrible shape. Um, but it's also 25,000. Yeah, I don't think we're doing that. That's a little out of my price range. I have sworn off cheap cars, though. If it's under like two grand or two or three thousand, you're not going to make any money off of it. Man, the neighborhood was actually rather full today. Uh, we got another one of these little Hondas. These can be a hit and miss. Uh, I see 108,000 kilometers. Nope, I'm not even going to look at it. Way too many miles. Uh, I've never sold one of these station wagons before. There's actually a couple of these. These are both hideous. Uh, uh, what is this thing? It's got 140,000 miles on it. No. Uh, what about this one? Uh, this one, this one's got a lot of damage on it. It's also $5,000. Yeah, I don't know where we're finding these. Uh, you know what? I don't think we've, we don't have time for any of these deals. Let's just go, uh, sell what we have. Also, do we have a price on this house yet? Uh, buy beer. Oh, it's $60,000. No, I'm, I'm not that rich. Okay, let's go ahead and repair this. Six hundred dollars or six sixty? Uh, not too bad. All right, let them work on that. You know, I finally saw somebody on a YouTube video interact with the junkyard. Uh, apparently, you get a sledgehammer at some point, and you can, I guess, break stuff up and collect trash too. Uh, am I supposed to bring this to you? Oh, so you come out here, you break the stuff, and you sell it back to him? What kind of business model is this? Okay, so for this episode, we are not going to crash my car. I've had such a horrible track record, and people have been yelling at me because I smash most of my cars. Also, why is there somebody in here? There's never anybody in here. I need to get my car painted. Come on, man. Can I hit this other car, or can I drive through it? Uh, you know what? Oh, there it goes. <laughs> I guess it just takes a little bit of patience here. All right, so what color do we want to do for this? Megan, you know what? Let's go with uh, just a traditional red. I think that looks actually really nice. There we go. All right, 300 bucks there. Uh, let's go get it a wash. Uh, I'd wash it myself, but the game still is like so hit and miss about trying to figure out what's actually dirty. It's like the car looks perfectly clean right now, but the game doesn't think so. Uh, all right, uh, let's go ahead. Oh, there's a leaderboard. Upgrades. Oh, they've, uh, they've changed up the... Looks like they changed everything up just a little bit here on the, uh, the menus. I wonder if maybe I can unlock my uh, tablet yet. I think I saw somebody else that actually had it. All right, so uh, title, uh, clean. Uh, buy, please. There we go. It's a perfect title for that. So we're 15K in. You know what? We're going for it. Let's go 30,000. I don't think anybody's going to pay for that. 
Uh, also, there's a price finder now. That's been added in the recent update. So that'll give you like a... Oh, that's a skill. Man, that's actually probably really useful to have. All right, that one's on sale. There we go. You know, we might actually play around with a loan this episode. That way I could speed this up. Is that a bad idea? How much will the bank give me? I mean, I could go gamble, but we've all seen that eh, that's a little questionable for me to do. Uh, I lost a lot. Uh, apply. Weekly payment, $1,100. Uh, I mean, this seems like it'd be a good thing. What if I were to go for, I don't know, 10000 Okay, it's 20 It's not a bad weekly payment. Uh, looks like I can get up to 35000 right now. What if I did 35000 That's a $7,000 weekly payment. Uh... <laughs> Now this is fine. Okay, so we're gonna do a $20,000 loan. Can I apply for this? Approved, there we go. We got a line of credit now, it's perfectly fine. All right, so we have a car on sale, and you know what? We can go back to that car market and buy something uh, else. Watch out, look who's back. Uh, I've got money in my pockets here. Uh, let's look at this BMW. What is this thing, 56,000? Uh, yeah, this is the one I was looking at earlier. Let's go ahead and get an expert to look at it. Man, it's expensive to do that. Uh, go ahead, expertise. Check this thing out. Make sure this guy is uh, not lying. Honestly, a pretty sweet looking ride. Was he telling the truth though? No, he was not. Um, there's stuff that this thing is missing and it's got damage. Oh, you better come down on the price a whole lot here, buddy. Uh, also, it turned into an old lady. Have we been here that long? So I've adjusted to the price uh, to 23,000. No, we're not even there. How about we go to 20,000? Did they make the bargaining easier? Uh, this offer is not satisfactory. You know what? Uh, 21,000. Uh, okay, so they went with 21,000 there. I think that's probably decent. Uh, it's gonna need some work to it though. Okay, let me know what the damage is. 700 bucks. Ooh, this thing's a, a bit of a pricey one, but I think it's gonna be uh, a okay. Is, does anybody wanna come buy my vehicle that I have out here? I need to make some money. Also, I didn't even check with the bank. Was there an interest rate on that? Um, I think I just took out that loan for funsies. All right, so we need to pay some bills here. Uh, what do we have? Uh, on? Uh, oh my, $7,000. Wait, oh, the bank loan already wants me to pay. Okay, uh, so the bank bills are always on Monday. Uh, well, we didn't get much of a buffer period with that, did we? <laughs> um, we're about to run out of money. All right, well, <laughs> we better pay our bills. You know, I just now noticed a new person here. Who's this guy? Homeless. What? What does that mean? Did I just give him money? Um. Uh, okay. Well, I, I could say I was a nice person. If I give you, uh, are you gonna give me something? Uh, okay. Well, I mean, I I, I just donated to somebody. Yeah, that that person's definitely new. They weren't here. Oh yeah. Uh, looks pretty decent. I think. I, I can't afford to paint it, but we're gonna go ahead and just uh, wash it real quick. Oh, I got customers. Hold on, let's shoot across the street. Uh, there's somebody over there. Please pay me good money for this. I need to go get this thing painted. Uh, what are you gonna give me? Uh, Thirty thousand. Uh, okay. What do you do? You have to think about this price. Wait, sixteen thousand. You know what? I would make money on that at sixteen thousand, but I'm literally gonna make like a thousand dollars. I can bargain down. I might actually just hold out. Like I feel like. That's probably my best uh, solution. Also, do not type in the wrong thing. I did that last episode and sold a car for $1,000. Uh, I'll give it to you for $25. How about that? Uh, 16 No, uh, that's... No, that's... I don't care. Uh, you, she looks angry, by the way. Uh, I'll wait for another customer. Okay, we got another person coming up. I'm going to put this one up for sale real quick. The BMW as is. Uh, it isn't, like, fully painted, which kind of sucks. But you know what? Uh, I got, oh my goodness, I'm almost 22000 into this one. I think we're going to go also with the $30,000 price tag and just see what happens here. Uh, let's talk to this person. Hey, you, you want to get, wait, no, this isn't the same person. I was about to say, uh, the price is bothering me. Man, they're pretty consistent on this price they're wanting. Uh, but if you hold out long enough, I did it last time. If you hold out long enough, you can get a much higher price. Let's go at $20,000. i will give you that. Uh... Yeah, now they're angry. You know what? I, I don't care. Just get the heck out of here. Yo, somebody lined up really quick for this one. Uh, how much do you want? Uh, the BMW? Come on, 30000 I can pay twenty one seven. 
Man, they're right on what I... It's like the game's doing this on purpose. Look, I bought the car for $21,000. I spent seven fifty dollars on it, and he wants to give it to where I would make $9. Like, come on. I swear this is the same person that was just here looking at this vehicle. Uh, $30,000. Come on. seventeen two. At seventeen two, I do make some money off this. Uh, let's see if I can get them to go up. You go up to 19000 Huh? How about that? Oh, I need to think. Uh, okay, there we go. We sold a car, 19000 All right, so we made money. Uh, it wasn't a whole lot, but hey, it kind of makes me think that we could probably uh, wait this one out and sell it for a good bit, too. Okay, we're back in the neighborhood. Uh, that looks like a Ford Focus. This is kind of a nice-looking car. All right, so it's 87,000 miles. Uh, they want 7,500. It's got some damage on it and stuff. Uh, that, that seems a little bit on the risky side. There's also an SUV. We haven't bought one of these. Uh, there's something wrong with the door, but other than that, I mean, this is a pretty decent looking vehicle. It's got 108,000 miles. It's pretty cheap, but man. Yeah, there's, uh, there's some problems with what's in the neighborhood today. All right, let's keep searching. Yo, look at this. This is the first time I've seen a Mustang. Um, it actually looks like it's in really good shape. I bet you this is going to be expensive. Uh, damage free. It's 28. You know, it's not as expensive as I thought it was going to be. Has a lot of mileage on it. Man, if we could sell off another car, uh, I wonder if moving to higher end uh, cars, maybe that would make us more money. Okay, we got somebody looking at the BMW. Come on. You know, you want to buy this thing for lots of money. 30000 Just give it to me. Just 30000 Price is bothering me. 28,000. Oh my goodness. That's good. That's going to net us quite a bit of profit. I wonder if I could milk it for just a little bit more. Uh, let's see if we can just get 29,000. Ah, uh, that's a thousand off the price. Price is bothering me. This car suits. There it goes. Boom. All right. So we've sold 50 cars already. Dude, we could go buy that Mustang now. This is the most money I've ever had. I mean, granted, I have a loan out too. Okay, so I definitely think we want somebody to look at this. So let's go ahead and pay the $2,800 for the expertise. Uh, let's give it a check. This is a very high-priced car. So it's definitely one of the more expensive ones that we bought. So I want to make sure that this thing does check out. Uh, oh, it's YI4. So YI4. Okay. Uh, give this a look over. Dude, we might be uh, might be nailing this. Come on, were they honest? Okay, there's some damage to this. Uh, it's going to hurt the price. Uh, definitely going to have to go down on that. What are they going to go down to? Uh, they went down about 3 k but that only paid for the expertise. I'm going to see if they'll take... Let's see if they'll take 2300 for it. You take 2300 I'm thinking. That offer is not satisfactory. I'll go 235 There we go. All right, so... We own it. Uh, it's also really dark. I can't see a thing. We should probably just take this back uh, to the lift. I do want to drive this one around. I want to see if it actually feels sporty. Okay, so only $200 worth of damage on this thing. I think we're going to paint it, uh, clean it up. I might even see... I, I need to double check. Does it have a racing kit in it? I wonder if we installed a racing kit, if we could charge a really good amount for this. All right, here we go. Hey, the, the homeless person moved. He's over here now. Um, I wonder if you keep giving him money. Like, I wonder if you get anything for that. I mean, maybe you're just being a good person. I'm not saying that you're supposed to expect to get stuff. But, you know, maybe there's something to it here in the game. Okay, how's this thing look now that it's been cleaned up? Oh, my goodness, it is beautiful. Dude, that red really pops now. Okay. So, yeah, that's definitely a vehicle. Like, you probably could have hand washed this one because it was visibly dirty. It's those other vehicles where it looks clean, but it still says it's dirty, where it kind of confuses me. But, man, dude, this thing, all right, it does rip pretty good. Oh, we got a little bit of NOS. Uh, actually, I probably shouldn't do that. Well, it says NOS. You know, there isn't NOS in here. It's just the controls lit up. So let's go ahead and get traction control on there. We're going to do the racing kit and the turbo and NOS. Boom. We have tuned this thing. I think she's ready to sell. We better put it away uh, before we wreck it. Uh, we honestly, we, we shouldn't do that. Okay, got some high mileage on it, but I mean, this is a good vehicle. I really wish I had the price finder. So right now we are about uh, 25, almost 26,000 into it. What if I just went crazy here? What if I said 50K? Uh, and then we can work down from there, right? That's reasonable for that mileage, <laughs> totally. Also, we need to eventually uh, decorate the office a bit. Uh, some people think that maybe it would increase the customer's like happiness 
and maybe they would give you more money so that might be a thing too that we need to pay attention to so the car market is open and i still have twenty thousand. i don't have to pay my bills until monday so uh, if we can make a couple more big deals happen i feel like we're gonna turn a nice profit here dude i don't think we've sold a truck yet that's actually kind of cool looking oh there's like a muscle car back here dude is that a chevelle oh dude that is nice looking uh, how much do you want for this? 65000 That's expected. I mean, it's a classic. Maybe eventually we'll be dealing in classic muscle cars, but uh, right now we can't afford it. Now, this truck, though, what is this thing? This looks like a... It's a Chevy Braze? Uh, okay. Uh, 8900 I mean, honestly, really low miles. And to me, trucks, they hold their value pretty good. Let's go and get an expert to look at this, make sure they're not lying to us. But I think this might definitely be a, a, a decent deal, especially if we fix it up. Okay, let's check the report. Um, guy looks like he was telling the truth completely. Like, it's clean. No damage. Like, come on. All right, let's see if we can get just a little bit off the price. You think they'll go 8000 Maybe? Huh? Oh, I need to think. The price uh, is below my expectations. How about 8250 That sounds fair, right? Uh, yay! Okay, there we go. It seems like the bargaining's a little bit easier than it's been. I wonder if it's been adjusted with a patch. Oh, yeah, look at this. Dude, this thing runs. Uh, it actually runs pretty good. You know, we're gonna drive this one back. Uh, I, I need to, like, actually explore the map a little bit, uh, just to see if there's any, like, secrets or maybe additional buying locations I just haven't even seen. Also, there is a totally another Mustang over here. Uh, yeah, there's a new one. It's like the cars come in batches. You know, I need to have a vehicle for myself. Maybe I would probably have like a cheap vehicle. Uh, I feel like we need to make money on this truck. H how much you want for this? Oh, this one's got really good mileage. It's 43,000 though. Man, yeah, that would have been a, a pretty decent deal. All right, let's get back in this. We need to get this thing, uh, make sure it's all fixed up and paint it. Uh, what about a, like a green or something? Actually, you know what? We haven't done a black on a vehicle. Let's just paint it. There we go. Uh, very nice. Hold on, can we, can we make it a little bit shinier? There we go. Honestly, this thing cleaned up pretty nice, uh, considering the age. Uh, I think this is going to be worth the investment. All right, let's park this one on the lot, too. Uh, we got to do this. I feel like we're going to make some good money here. Okay, so we're not that much into it. Let's just go $25,000. we will start there. I feel like all of our prices are extremely high right now, but it's fine. Somebody's going to actually... Uh, they're going to go for this, I think. Oh, I've got another dude looking at the Mustang here. Huh? What are you going to tell me about the price? Uh, trust me, you need this car. I'm thinking, I think I'll pay the same price for it. Wait, you're going to give me 50000 for this? Could I have gone more? Dude. Okay, you know what? Dude, that was awesome. All right, we're up to $60,000. Do we, I mean, we could go buy the other Mustang real quick. Uh, we got that money. We know these things sell, and that one had less miles. I think we could get more money for it. We have finally figured this out, folks. Uh, we're no longer going to go bankrupt until I go gamble at the blackjack table. You know, we're not going to go gambling. Uh, that's for uh, desperate measures. I mean, we could lay down 60000 and double our money to 120, but, you know, it's fine. All right, let's look at this one. Uh, oh, really, game? We just missed that. So yeah, where that Mustang was for sale, it's now a Tesla. Uh, I'm not quite in the Tesla market yet. I, I, I'm in the muscle car market. I need another like muscle car Mustang. Uh, give me a V8 Charger or something. Yo, back at the neighborhood. Look, there's a truck. It's a Ram. Dude, that's actually kind of nice looking. Uh, what's the story on this thing? 137,000 miles. That's a lot. It's dirty. It doesn't look like it has much damage. I haven't dealt in a truck like this. Uh, let's get an expert to look at this one. I'm actually genuinely curious. I like that the game is like throwing new cars at us. So how much for this thing? It's pretty sweet looking. Um, were they telling the truth though? Oh, they were. Okay, well, we've got better bargaining now. So you think we can get a better price? Let's go ahead and bargain here. I'm going to lowball them here. I'm going to see... Let's go 13.5 just to see if they'll buy it on something like that since I have the better uh, bargaining. Uh, okay, they just gave that for that price. Uh, yes, okay. <laughs> let's go take that one back. Uh, maybe we can pick up another car. Oh, look at that. <laughs> it's a BMW. I mean, a Supra. Let's go ahead and... Uh, how much is this thing? $70,000. Uh, that's... Honestly, that's a little high. Uh... <laughs> I mean, I guess maybe certain versions might be worth that, uh, but yeah, not currently that one. That's so neat looking though that they have that in here. 
Yo, honestly, I would probably keep one of these trucks if I could. Uh, we need to make our money first. All right, let's go. I think we're going to upgrade the truck slightly. Uh, maybe put like a racing kit. Make sure it's got all the uh, the good stuff. And then we're going to stick this thing for sale. And we got three vehicles uh, that we will have there. All right, let's go ahead and do the turbo. And let's do the racing kit on it. Uh, there we go. Do we need anything else? Oh, we can actually upgrade the lights. Is that new? Uh, I kind of feel like it is. Uh, actually, I kind of like that. There we go. Suspension. Uh, it's already as low as it'll get. Uh, you can even do like the license plate, which I guess that would be for like your personal vehicle. I don't know if it'd be worth it to do it uh, with a vehicle you're selling. Okay, so the last thing we got to do here, let's go ahead and put the Dodge pickup for sale. So we are in it about, uh, I would say 14, uh, close to 1500. Let's just try 35,000. Hey, we got somebody looking at the truck. Hey, this is a nice truck for 35,000, right? Uh, do you, what do you think? Oh, they'll pay 20,000. That would actually put us at decent, uh, I would say decent profit. Uh, let's see if we can get milk a little bit more. Let's go maybe 23,000. How will you do that? Uh, oh, wait a minute. Can you lower it? Uh, can we work out a decent price? Uh, okay. You know what? Just because I like you, let's try, uh, let's try 20,000. Will you give me a little bit more on this? Uh, Yep, there we go. All right, so we sold the truck. So we made money on it. Uh, we finally got it down. We're up to 52000 I've got two cars on the lot that's going to bring us in even more cash. And then, you know what? I think uh, to end it off here, let's see if we can do something. Uh, upgrading the office. Right, it's 200000 to do that. I can get an extra tow slot, which my tow slot one doesn't seem to be working anymore. Uh, so let's go ahead and do tow slot number two. And then we could always decorate maybe the uh, the out design. What can we do here? Can we do, oh, we can do like different like uh, grounds and stuff like that. What about fences? Uh, we can do shrubs and stuff like that. It's 10,000 for shrubs. Uh, we'll do a small upgrade there. See, maybe we'll get some better prices. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Thank you guys for all the love support on the series. And we'll see you guys next time.